get loose. The thing about Lensicum, even when he starts a game, he never needs more than 15 pitches to warm up. I don't think Bruce Bochy can afford to wait much longer, but keep in mind, Lensicum warms up just like that. When he starts a game, rarely more than 15 pitches, and he's ready. He's into the game with two on, two out, and Johnny Peralta at the plate. Fifth game of the Cincinnati in relief of Zito. Strike two. Prior to this year, Lincecum had never pitched out of the bullpen professionally. Lincecum slams the door in the top of the sixth. Six to one. Continuing to get loose. Strike one. Two time Cy Young Award winner in 08 and 09. Guy who led the National League in strikeouts three straight years. Five run lead. He gets a swinging strikeout to start the seventh. So the illusion of a strike was there. That more than velocity. Off the hands, strike two. Faced three strikeouts for Tim Lincecum. But relief and relaxation. Here's a chop to the right side. Scooter awaits. Gets the speed bearing. When you talk about relief, that's exactly what Tim Lincecum has provided tonight for Barry Zito and the Giants. And have a couple of days between the third time tonight. Do it leading off an inning for the second time he went. And that's strikeout number four for Tim Lincecum. One out here in the eighth. Well, we were talking about the illusion of a strike. And again, Austin Jackson goes too far. You know, the Detroit Tigers know of no other pitcher in the American League who throws like Tim Lincecum. He is so unusual in that delivery. He's a come in the National League. He now watching after his first World Series start. His long career. Two out. Two out. Nobody on. Here is Cabrera. Gale's been on base twice with a walk in RBI center. Anybody that's a more imposing figure at the plate then Miguel Cabrera standing right on top of it waving the bat still loud and still packed here at at and Park two out one two pitch a strikeout by Lincecum who has been perfect through two and a third. Bottom of the eighth inning rolls in. Number 55 pitching well as the Giants lead by seven. They call him the freak, and while the Giants make a switch in pitchers, Jenny O invites you to switch to Turkey. And Tim Lincecum, the numbers are staggering. Ten and two-thirds innings out of the bullpen this postseason. One run on three hits. Along the way, he has racked up 14 strikeouts. Walked only one. In relief of Ryan Vogelsong. Peralta takes that great stuff. The 0-2. That's into right center field. It will tail right to Pence. And the inning is over. Five and two-thirds shutout. He loved it. Two-nothing. 
chopped off the plate. Lincecum to the bag, and an easy out as it turns out. Tigers Tigers before the, the end of this one. They've had their chances tonight. Here's a flat ball into right. Easy for Hunter Pence. Two out, nobody on. First pitch of ball to Jackson, and now a swinging strike. Here's a 2-1. Two, 2-2 two and two from Tim Lincecum, Cy Young Award winner, who is... Now a huge weapon out of the bullpen for Bruce Bochy. He looks like he's got better stuff today and tonight than he did his first round in game one. A three off. Chase the pitch, that good now delivery one from Lincecum. Lincecum. And Barry strikes out for the second time tonight. Oh for three as he gets it. Shattered back. Nice diving stop, Crawford. What a 19 straight errorless games for Crawford. Lincecum, the guy who committed it. Fielder. Takes a strike this series. Lincecum is rolling. Here's an 0-2. Struck him out on three pitches. Two out. DH for the Tigers. Strike one. Team Andy Dirks. Up with takes now the 1 1. Bottom fall with two out and a 1 2 pitch coming to Dirks. A strikeout and, and the team is still can't find a big hit. We go to the ninth inning of game three. Giants batting up 2 0. That ends it. Giants take a three games to nothing lead. And brilliant pitching again here tonight by San Francisco. Vogelsong, no! Lincecum, no! and Romo. No! It bears repeating, Tigers were shut out twice this year during the regular season no! of 162 Whoa! games. They've been shut out two games Woo! in a row, both two nothing losses here in the World Series. Unbelievable. In the National League, you have to go back to the 1919 Reds. Who did it to the White Sox, that Black Sox scandal in the World Series back-to-back -back shutouts. Last time in World Series play, the 1960s.